we're gonna do a short yoga practice that anyone can do to help manage stress and navigate our busy lives. We're gonna start with focusing on the breath. It's the very first thing that we do, rolling the shoulders up back and down. If you'd like, you can take one hand to your low belly and the other hand to your heart and just notice the movement of your hands. It's that simple, breathing in and out. Notice that you're here and that you have feet on the floor, that you have strength to stand. Continue to breathe naturally and just see if you can take a fuller, deeper breath. Lower the palms down by your side. We're gonna find mountain pose. It's the foundation of everything we do in yoga. So rooting down through the left foot and the right foot, soft bend in your knees and a lift through the crown of the head, shining the palms towards the front of you so that you can find your strength. Take a big breath in. Keep that length and exhale. Adding movement with breath is like a moving meditation. It's magic. Take a big breath in, reaching the arms up and overhead. Exhale, hands will come together at heart center. That's it, you're doing yoga. Three more, inhale, reach up, breathe in. Exhale, hands come to heart center. Two more, breathe in, get tall. Exhaling, hands come to heart center. One more time, big breath in, reach up. Exhaling, hands come to heart center. If you only had one minute, that would be a complete yoga practice. We're gonna continue. Big breath in, reaches up. Keep the arms lifted, keep the chest lifted. Exhale, cactus the arms to a 90 degrees. Inhale, reach back up towards the sky. Exhale, hands will come to your heart. Inhale, sit back into an imaginary chair and bring your arms forward like you're holding on to a special gift. Take a big breath in and an exhale out. Keep the arms forward. Inhale all the way up to standing. Big breath in. Exhaling, hands will come to the heart. Now take a nice big wide step out to the left. Hands on the hips, stand up tall. Feet facing the same direction, take a big breath in. Keep the belly engaged and exhale, hinge at the hips. Root down through your feet, inhale to come back up. And then take the left toes out towards the left. Bending into the left knee, 90 degrees, making sure that the knee is tracking right over the heel. We're coming into warrior two. So you can start with hands on hips, rooting down through the back foot so that the knife edge of the back foot is also rooting down and then finding a little engagement of the belly in and up. You can stay right here with hands on hips or take the arms out by your side like you just completed your mission. You just won your battle. Good, take a peek over the left fingertips, the middle finger on that left hand, and breathe. Commit to the front knee bend, breathe. We're gonna reverse this warrior, keeping the lower body exactly the same Taking the right hand to the hip, flipping the front palm up. Inhale, reverse, reach up towards the sky. Exhale, we'll bring you back through warrior two, both arms out by your side. Straightening the front leg now, hinging forward at the hips and coming into triangle pose. So the gaze can look down towards the, the left foot or across the room or up towards the sky. As long as you're breathing, you're doing good. Good, take two more breaths there. Strong in your triangle pose, stretching the side waist, working the legs, rooting down. When you are ready to come out of that pose, take the right hand to your hip, straighten that front leg, other hand can come to your hip and you're coming right back into the feet parallel, wide stance. This time let's raise our arms up, take a big breath like you're a giant X. Exhale, hands to the hips and we'll come halfway down. Inhale, we'll come back up, we'll take the left foot and bring it towards the right and land right back in your mountain pose. Take a big breath in, reach up. Exhale, cactus, lift the chest. Inhale, reaches back up. Exhale, hands come to your heart. Let's sit down into our chair, squat. Good, big breath in, big breath out. Keep rooting through the feet. Inhale, reaching up towards the sky. Exhaling, lowering the hands down by your side. Inhale is going to bring the right leg out. We'll come into that wide-legged stance with the feet in the same direction. Take a big breath in. Exhale, 
Hinge at the hips. Inhale brings you back up like you could float towards the sky, taking the right toes out. Hands stay on the hips, bend into that front knee. Bump the back heel as far as you feel comfortable doing, and then root down through both of your feet. Find mountain here. Good, warrior two, you just completed your battle, reaching the arms out by your side, peeking over the front middle finger if that feels comfortable for you. Commit to the front knee bend. Nice, keep breathing, keep reaching. Move the knee back over the ankle just a little bit. There you go. And then take the left hip to the uh, left hand to the hip. Flip the front palm up. Commit to that lower knee bend. Breathe in, reach up. Reverse your warrior. Exhale comes back through your warrior two, arms out. Straighten the front leg. Reach forward with the right fingertips like a million bucks is over there. And then come down into your triangle pose. The gaze can be down towards the floor, across the room, and try taking the left hand to the hip just for a little bit more support. There you go, awesome. Good, breathe. Feeling your strength, feeling your balance. When you're ready, taking both hands to the hips, straightening into the front leg, taking the feet back into a parallel base. We'll reach up with our breath, take a big breath in, Exhale, hinge forward at the hips. Coming back, up, use your breath. Right foot will step back to center. And then we'll just return back to mountain. Mountain pose is something you can do when you only have one minute. Breathe, feel free to close down the eyes if you're comfortable here. And just acknowledge your strength. When you're ready, lower the hands down by your sides roll your shoulders, and you just did yoga.